Hello, imaginary friends! Sorry, I look kind of a mess. Uh, I'm not wearing any makeup, and my hair is kind of like, it's just back in a little clip. Because today isn't a going out day, it's a staying in and doing things day. Or at least right now it is. I'm going to take a shower and go out in a couple of hours, but right now I'm doing my chores. The reason why is because today's Monday, and on Monday I do a lot of my weekly chores. Uh, one in particular that I do every Monday is laundry. So I do that in an order. First I do clothing, like the clothes you wear on your body. Uh, I wash all that first. Then I do bath towels, and then after bath towels I do dish towels. I use a lot of dish towels every week. These are the main thing I use for cleaning everything. Like I use these to lay out flat to dry dishes on. And I use them to wash dishes, and I use them to dust, and I use them to scrub the counter. I use them to, like, everything that requires, like, cloths, um, except for things that are, like, gross. Like, I use, I use paper towels for, like, if one of my cats throws up or something like that. But everything that's, like, reasonable to use these for, I use these for because I try to minimize my use of paper towels as much as possible because they cost money and they're not great for the environment. So today I'm folding these and I figured, hey, might as well show you all how I fold things and how I put them away. There's a process to this too. So the first thing I do once they're out of the wash, so I wash them on the sanitary setting on my washing machine, which is like super hot and it's a pretty long load because you never know, like I want these to be as clean as possible since they are gonna be touching like clean dishes. These are my dishes, by the way. I have fiesta wear. Ooh, ah. So what I do is, when they come out of the dryer, I put them on the counter. But before I do that, I always clean the counter first. Because if I took out a whole bunch of clean towels that have just taken like two hours to wash and dry, and it turned out that the counter was dirty or wet, and they all had to be rewashed, I think my little heart would break and I would cry. So I always clean the counter first, and I always clean the things I put them in. The things I'm putting them in right now, and have been for a couple years, aren't great. Um, it's a Rachel Ray baking dish that I think I got at um, Target years ago. I got it because it matched the table I had, but that table's not in here anymore, so I don't really need an orange thing. But Whatever, it's what I use and it fits well. And the other thing I use is this bread pan. Um, but I need to find something else because I actually like making bread. And um, there have been a couple times where I've had to take all of the washcloths out in order to wash to make bread. And that's stupid and I need to stop doing that. So the way I fold these is, let's see if you'll be able to see this. I don't know if you will or not. I don't wanna fiddle with this. If I fiddle with this thing too much, it falls over. I need to get a whole better setup for doing this kind of thing. So I've always folded towels like this. I take it long ways like this, fold it in half, and kind of shake it. And then I fold it in thirds. You can't really see that because it's down here, but fold it in thirds like that. That's how I used to fold them whenever I put them in a drawer. But now that I keep them out on the counter, which I think is like, I feel like it's cleaner to have them out and about where I can see them. And um, they're more likely to be recycled that way. Like in a drawer, one could get pushed back to the very back and it could get like very dusty or stale or something. Um, but when I started doing the KonMari method a couple years ago, I changed how I fold this. And so now I fold it the same way, but I now fold it in the middle too. And the theory is, if you do this correctly, it should stand up on its own. Ta-da! So I could just put them on the counter stood up like this. Like I could just move this bowl out of the way and just have all my towels standing up. But they're not like super good at standing up this way. And if the wrong thing hit them, they could all just come tumbling down. Actually, this did it better than I thought it would. So for right now, I'm gonna continue using a container. Also, that's good like in case a whole bunch of water or something was spilled, this protects them from anything like that. So I'm gonna fold another one. It's also a good time for me to check and see if any of them have holes or stains or anything that like needs to be taken care of. Fold this one. 
I do things in such a fussy manner. I'm a fussy person. I mean, that's all there really is to it. I do things very specific ways, and I do them the same ways every time. Because, oh, see, this one has holes in it. Um, but mostly it's okay. It only has two holes in it, so I think I'm going to keep this for now. But it's going to get taken out of rotation pretty soon. I get all these at Target, by the way. I like the little waffle pattern because um, it's good for dusting and scrubbing. So that's one thing that I do on this day of the week is dish towels. Other thing I do is uh, cloth napkins. I use these if somebody comes over for dinner or like if I have dinner and need a napkin, I use these. They're not cut very straight. I got these at like an outlet mall and they're cut funny. So they're always going to fold funny and I've just learned to accept that. At first it bothered me a lot, but now I'm okay with it. I fold these in half and then I fold these in thirds and they go right up here. Oh, that was not a good job. That's where I keep all of these. I use these, like I said, for people coming over for dinner. Um, I also use them for putting between my skin and an ice pack because I have to ice my knee every day. So I use one of these every day for icing my knee. And the other thing I wash every Monday is washcloths. They're also from Target. Uh, they mostly, I try to get them to match, but because things wear out at different times, they end up not matching. Every spring I buy new towels. So, And these I fold in half and then I just fold in thirds. I think the theory is also that these would stand up, but I don't think they will. I've never tried it. Let's see. Uh, huh. Ta-da! It does. Well, that's fascinating. So I'll fold this one too. And that's it. Uh, there are a lot. Like, this is only a portion of them. I actually folded some of the others already before I got the idea to do this video. Oh, here's one I missed. See, this one's kind of frayed on one end, but it still works, so we're going to keep it. Waste not, want not. Frugality is an important virtue. So I already did a whole bunch before I got the idea to do this. So here they are. Put them in here. So you can see the lovely joy that is clean dish towels. This is one of those things that makes me happy every week. Every week whenever I fold and put away the dish towels, I feel happy, I feel accomplished, I feel like things are orderly, and it's such an easy task for such a big emotional payoff. That's why I like folding and putting away my clothes and other little tasks like that because it's not a lot of work but then you end up with something that looks really pretty, really well organized, and you can always find the things you're looking for. And that's really helpful to me personally to know where my things are. So that's it. I'm gonna go actually work on baking a cake. That's what my plan is for today. Ooh, cake. And um, that's all. Hope you are having a wonderful day. Talk to you later, bye.